In this episode of Live at Paco's Place, we have the very talented Miss Noreen Lani. Hello! Hi, guys! Oh, eh, hindi pa eh. Ay, hindi pa. <laughs> oh, no money! <laughs> pang gagril lang namin yun. <laughs> pang funny moments namin yun. <laughs> Kala mo, ha? <laughs> Na-excite! <laughs> Don't worry, you're not the first. Pambiktima namin yun. So, <laughs> okay, I'll wait na lang until you look at me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay, 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 sorry. And the podcast will begin in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ladies and gentlemen, the very talented Miss Noreen Lani. <laughs> Hi, Noreen. Hi, Paco. You want to greet our um, listeners and viewers? Hello, listeners and viewers. It's <laughs> true. It's true. It's true. Stop laughing. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Ready na. Ready na. Ready ka na. Okay. <laughs> Kamusta ka na? Okay naman. Super happy to be here. Ako rin. We're super happy to have you. Thank dapat, you. Dapat uh, matagal na. Pero sabi nga namin ni na Michael, when we had Jamie, sabi ko, wait, 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 wait. Parang kulang eh. Dapat nandito rin si, si Noreen. Mm. So, kami ni na Michael, ni na JJ, sabi namin, okay, we'll make it our mission to bring you Thank to bring you, you here. Thank you so much. I enjoyed oh. the interview mo with Jamie. I watched it. It was so fun. No, you know what? Thank you for that. And game kasi si Jamie. Oh. oh, oh. Sabi nga ni Jamie, kala ko tatanungin mo kung paano ako na ano eh. Na, na ano, na ano. Kasi, <laughs> sabi ko, medyo wholesome naman. Sabi niya, oo nga, natatakot ako dahil ang alam ng mami ko. <laughs> I love her mom. I love tita, her Tita, if you're watching. Hi, Tita Liza. <laughs> Wala po akong alam. <laughs> okay. Question is, ano ba perception? Why, 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 um, why are you tensing up? And you're not the only one. Yung mga ibang bisita namin at Paco's Place, parang, okay, eto na. Ano ba perception na meron ng Paco's Place? At... Hindi naman sa ganun, pero hmm. I guess like, eh, basta, kasi nga... <laughs> I feel like, ano sasabihin ko? Okay, in all honesty, when you reached out to me and said na, oh, did you know, did Michael Abad reach out to you yet to be, you know, a guest? Yeah. I was like, huh? Ako? <laughs> Bakit ako? Yes, you. Bakit ako? And so, when you guys both reached out nga and, and, and Michael scheduled it, parang, wow, oh, that's so kind that they want to talk to me. Everybody wants to talk to you. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Una una you have a show, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, actually, tinitingnan ko ngayon yung ano, yung yung time, running time natin 3 minutes and 30 seconds as of right now. Mm-hmm. Ibig sabihin mas matagal ka nang nandito sa show ko <laughs> kaysa ako sa show mo. <laughs> That's not my choice. That's not my choice. I just do what they tell me. Paupo pa lang ako pinaalis na ako eh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry ko lang iyato. So tagal pa yung binahi ko kesa sa... <laughs> it wasn't my choice. I wanted to talk to you more. <laughs> Di ba? Oh. Si, si Jovi, wrap it up, wrap it up. Wrap it up. Katatanong lang sa akin ni Noreen, wrap it up na kagat. Oh, sorry. <laughs> let's talk about yeah. ano, let's <clears throat> let's talk about you as an actress cuz <clears throat> that Amazon <clears throat> that Amazon movie, that indie movie. Is it an indie film? Is it yung narration ko or is it the one that with Randy? Uh, with Randy. <laughs> sabi ko, and you know what, si Randy, I've known Randy for a while sa Facebook. Ah, really? Okay. Ano na, ako sabi ko, apa? Wait, apa? <laughs> but di ko alam tutukol kay Randy and all that stuff. And, oh, really? Yeah. You knew him from, not as an actor, from somewhere else? Like I just a... knew him as Randy with an H. Oh! 
Randy, if you're watching. Hi, Randy! Ano siya ka? Ka-love team ko siya Yun sa mga nga. movies. Tapos all of a sudden, may, may Amazon movie kayo and all that. Can we talk about that title and everything else? Sure. Sige, sige. Um, it's called The Perfect Perfect Strangers. Mm-hmm. No, the Perfect Strangers. And um, it's directed by Anna Barredo. And okay. she just reached out to us kasi um, Randy and I were in another movie of hers, a feature film uh, called uh, The Year I Did Nothing. That's also on uh, Prime Video, Amazon okay. Prime Video. Um, narrator ako doon. Si Randy yung played the dad in that movie. Which actually, I, I that's where I met him. Um, the uh, nag audition ako to be the wife in right. that movie, pero I didn't, I didn't, didn't get, get that role. role. No, okay. no. But I asked the director, "Oh, can I, can I try out to be the narrator?" Mm. Yun, yun. So that one we part na yon. Yeah, okay. yeah. But um, so because of that experience, Anna reached out to Randy and me and said, "Hey guys, I have this idea. You know, are you game? Uh, it's it's about two people meeting online." during quarantine. So we're like, yeah, sure, sure. But the project because everything was filmed at home. My kids, my girls were my <laughs> DP. And, oh my you know, God. Yeah. So and was super low-key and Anna so nice. Do you know Anna? No. no. Ah, you Maybe we could invite her here. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah she, so Miss Anna awesome. Barredo, yeah. this is an open invitation. Anna. <laughs> take it, take it. Yeah. She works for CBS and uh, yeah, yun, like, uh, the, the, the Year I Did Nothing was her first feature film. That was Yung Perfect Strangers. Um, she wrote it herself, edited it herself. Um, and so yun, she produced it, technically. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. So, lahat, 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 lahat siya. And um, do you want to know, like, did you watch it, ba? No. Uh, no, no, no. no. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sabi ko kasi, okay. I have this um I have this attitude sa Paco's place to keep everything kosher. Mm-hmm. Like <clears throat> kami ni na Mike ni na JJ we do minimal research. Ah okay okay. Bye Just bye. because we want to know the person from what the person wants to to share. Oh, and okay. the goal namin is to inspire and inform other people. So the premise was how do we inspire and inform other people kung hindi tayo nagre-research? Well, the research happens when you come in. Mm-hmm. Which means the conversation. The conversation <coughs> becomes the research per se. Got it. Okay, so, okay. ang ginagawa lang namin is, what's an overview of this person? Tipong ganon. Like, okay. like, we've worked together in per music, so we'll talk about <coughs> that later. Okay. But this is one facet na ako personally na fascinate. Mm-hmm. Sabi ko, aba, aba. <laughs> Hindi ko alam kay Norin to. At pati kay Randy. Sabi ko ganun. And, and this, you know, yung, yung pag nabigla ka, yun, normally yun ang nakaka-inspire eh. Mm. Nakaka-motivate yun when, when the person you know does something out of the, out of your perception box. Got it. Okay. And yeah. then napapa, napapaano ka eh. Whoa. And yun yeah. yung ginawa mo. Yay! <laughs> like si Jamie, just to talk about her. Mm-hmm. And I'm sure kinikiligan that we're talking about her. Hi, Jamie! <laughs> Hindi namin alam that she, produced, she produces her own album. She's amazing. We yeah. had no idea. Yeah. So when she was sharing it with us for the first time, kaming tatlo talagang, what? Aha, uh-huh. yeah, grabe. Oh, ang galing niya, ang galing niya. Oh. Diba? Yeah. So now, going back to your question, if I watch it, no, mm-hmm. because I want to talk to you first About and it. then watch it. Okay. And now, <laughs> meron akong, alam mo yun, na parang, yeah, yeah. Ah, may breadcrumbs ako. Okay, okay. And I'm pretty sure yung mga tao magkaka-breadcrumbs then Sige. after this interview when they watch it. Okay. Okay, let's talk about that. Without being, uh, without uh, doing any spoiler <clears throat> alerts and all that stuff. Wala tayo spoiler alert. Okay. So basically, I know, uh, single ako. Sa, it's just a short film. Um, and single si Randy. Eh, pero parehong pareho kami. Yung mannerisms namin, yung mga tendencies namin, yung iniinom namin, kinakain namin, lahat-lahat, pareho. And uh, we meet online. He decides to go online and I go online. And yun. So it's like, oh my gosh, you have, you like that? I like that. Ganyan, ganyan. Uh, lahat. Pero merong, ano, ah... Uh, May caveat. Ano, sa, uh, the ending. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Yun ang natin. Now, how, when you say short film, how short is the film? Gosh, I think maybe 10 minutes lang. 10 Grabe, minutes. No? Yeah, yeah. Well, that's a short film. Yeah. And yung feature so, film na ginawa nyo, how long was that? An hour 30? Yeah, parang mga ganun. Yeah. How many movies have you done? Ah, uh, let's see. I did uh, horror, lullaby, short film, puro mga short film except for that narration yes. sa feature film. So, uh, lullaby is a horror film by Dale Fabregar. Tapos yung The Year I Did Nothing with Anna Barredo. 
and then um, I did one Sana Sinabi Mo by Lloyd E. Torres. Torres and Sirandi din ng sawa ko dun. <laughs> Actually, okay, okay. Can I just tell you? <laughs> yes, tell me everything. <laughs> okay, so, nung nang audition kami ni Randy sa, sa The Year I Did Nothing, that was the first time I ever met him, no? And it was mm. a cold read. Right. So I never met him before, whatever. And then, uh, nung ginagawa namin yung, ano, yung cold read, we really hit it off. Like there was a chemistry, the chemistry there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, you know, he he was really hoping na makuha ko yung role, and I was really, like, it was just easy. You know, sometimes like it's just easy. Right. Um, pero hindi ko na kuha. But in my mind, like I was always like, oh, I hope I get to work with him someday. E yun din pala yung isip niya. And so, thankfully, you know, uh, an opportunity came up. Yung sana sinabi mo yun. I played his wife in that one. Um, that was actually Michael. It's a UCI uh, grad director film. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so this is this is so basically, para na kami love team. Yun. <laughs> I mean, not at the time. I mean, it started out with that. Tapos, right. uh, and then um, I auditioned also for another one in San Diego, and I got that. Then she did yung mga sawa ko. <laughs> and then yun nga kay Anna. She did na nasawa ko. <laughs> and then he had another film. Uh, he he recommended me. I auditioned. Ako din na maasawa niya. <laughs> and then one more that's upcoming. Uh, hindi pa namin na film. Uh, and I'll be his wife there too. So, <laughs> you know, mga films. Okay, namin. so one, two, I'm, three, four, five, wait, wait. six. And one without him. <laughs> ano one, feeling? Uh, ano him. feeling ng one without him nakakalungkot, no? Oh, hindi. <laughs> <laughs> Buti na lang Tagalog yung tanong ko, no? No offense, Randy, ah. Yeah. <laughs> Because see, even my husband was like, everything you're going to do with him. <laughs> no, I, I, I mean, single wife ako, single, single mom ako, and the one by myself. You know, we didn't explain to you. Or... <laughs> Wait, what did I say? What is that? Wait, I'm going to pull this okay. up. Okay. Um, <laughs> wait, okay, so... Lakas ako yung AC or okay lang? Paano ba ito? Tatawa na lang ako this whole time. Um, yung ano, uh, I had an, uh, the one by myself kay Romel and Daya naman and uh, that one, um, single mom ako. And so it was kind of nice to just, you know, play a different role naman without like having to always be Randy's wife. Okay. <laughs> But ay, ay tsaka yung lullaby yung horror. Uh, I mean, I'm married, but I, it's Not just Randy, me and the baby. Uh, <laughs> Randy's baby din to. I want ko, hindi ko pa siya kilala noon. <laughs> so out of the eight or nine that you mentioned, tatlo lang o dalawa ang wala si Randy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay lang. Now this this acting <clears throat> bug. Mm-hmm. By the way, guys, ano lang, disclaimer, nagbibiroan lang kaming lahat. Ha. Um, itong acting bug na to, is this something that's been with you growing up or, or bago lang to? No, uh, since ano pa ako, maliit pa ako, pa ako. <laughs> <laughs> maliit pa ako, pa ako. <laughs> so maliit pa, ginigaya-gaya ko si Janice de Belen. Okay. You know, like ginigaya ko yung mga host sa Eat Bulaga. Yeah. Uh, Pero it was never like nurtured or encouraged. You know what really? I mean? Really? Oh, wait, let's talk about um, growing up. How many siblings do you have? Apat kami. Bunso ako. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. So girl, boy, girl, girl. Girl, boy, girl, girl. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Tapos, um, where did you grow up? So Philippines or dito? Uh, I was born there. Mm. Tapos uh, sa ano kami, Quezon City. And then I moved here when I was about to turn eight. So Wow. Yeah, in the wow. 80s. Okay. So now, when you came here, when you say it wasn't encouraged, uh, anong gusto nang anong gusto gawin ng mommy daddy mo? Parang go to school and that's it. Well, <laughs> by I the think, way, kaya tumitingin dun si Noreen. And shout out to you, Anne, who's also Hi, here Anne. with us. Hi, Anne. I dragged her with me. <laughs> um, I mean, I. I joined, okay, nung junior high ako, I was in drama class, I was in musical theater. You know, would your parents watch? Na, yeah, yeah, okay. I mean, they would watch them. And, pero as far as making it like a career, it was not, you know, really uh, encouraged. encouraged uh-huh. Kasi nga, you know, it's not very stable. And they wanted me to finish college first. What'd so, you take up? <clears throat> uh, psychology and social behavior, tsaka minors education. Psychology? <clears throat> yeah. Okay. <laughs> don't ask, I don't remember anything I learned. 
Nandiyan yung mga MEQ, emotional quotient, and all that stuff. Wala na akong alam. <laughs> so, you do, and, but, but you, do you have a day job? Ah, uh, yes, yes. Hindi psychologist? <clears throat> well, I mean, I guess you could be part of it then, but teacher ako. Anong high school, grade school? Grade school, grade school. Uh, is it better to teach grade school uh, kids or high school kids? I guess it <coughs> depends sa uh, ano mo. Um, sa gusto mo. Kasi ako, like, I'm very nurturing. And, right. Yeah. So, mas, I think mas bagay ako sa mga bata. Mm. Um, pero, <coughs> I have a sister-in-law and she teaches junior high and she likes it. So, depende lang, I think, right, you know. Right, right. I yeah. see. Now, going back, growing up, hindi na nurture yung iyong acting. You went, in, you, you went to college, but you still had that passion in the back burner. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And the reason why I'm talking to you this way about that is because and daming taong frustrated na feeling nila hindi na nila maipalalabas yung yung passion nila nung bata sila but here you are with a family and yet doing this. Yeah. Yeah. May day job people. and doing this. Mm-hmm. Diba? How do you make it work? Well, uh, support kay Michael. You know, Michael's husband. your husband. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's been very supportive. And um, I think because he sees that it brings me so much joy. Mm-hmm. Um, and when you're happy, he's happy. Yeah! <laughs> happy wife, happy life. Diba? Yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, I, I, and plus, because like, with, uh, with teaching, um, it's more flexible. Like, the so summertime, you know, a lot of things I do, like, the so summer or, like, my break or, you right. know, the, I don't do it, like, during, you know, the weekdays when I'm, you know, teaching, but um, I just choose like things that will work with my schedule. How's how's the conversation like with Michael? Uh, how do you talk about the project? Ah, uh, nagugulat na lang ba siya na sa pupunta or <laughs> or do no, you guys? I tell him. Yeah, yeah. yeah sit down. I Michael, tell him. sit down. Uh, uh, uh. I have to tell you something. Yeah. Okay. Meron pa akong, okay. Our Michael friend here knows the story, but I'll share with you. Kung yes. ano y- okay, so kasi you have to know the whole story. Kung I, why, why we, we all want to know the whole story. <laughs> why my Michael is I know, supportive now because uh, in the past he wasn't. Sa college. Ah. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. College so, pala magkakilala na kayo? Yes. Yeah, we went to the same college. So, um, okay. Okay. Ito ang story. So back in 1999, one of my actually two of our cousins works at ABS-CBN. So I, you know, I used to visit her a lot. Uh, Ate Maylin, hi, Ate Maylin. <laughs> um, but uh, one of the days when she wasn't there, like she just had a friend, you know, take us uh, ASAP. Yeah. Um, Ether came up to me afterwards and said that Mr. M was wondering if I was interested in the business in acting, nice. like if I sing or dance. Did you say yes? I did, pero guess what? I was going back home here that night. Like, I literally just squeezed in, you know, an ASAP visit that night. And I, I was supposed to fly back home. So, um, we waited a lot around for a little bit afterwards. Pero, you know, I had to catch a flight. And, you know, uh, the flight could have waited. Hindi ko kasi kilala si Mr. I mean, I knew like he was, you know, uh, with Dieter and, you know, the, the one in charge of ASAP. Pero, I guess at the time, I don't know, bakit. I guess I was scared. I know, <laughs> but ugh. oh my okay. god! I know. I just not I was just with my aunties, and you know, I, I, but that, I, I know, I know. You see what see, I mean? See, Mr. M is a nice guy. Very nice guy. He seems very nice. I, mean, I, I actually we didn't talk because I, I, I had to leave. Na I gave Dether my email. <laughs> Wala pang cell phone. Naman, oh, hindi naman ni stock ni Dether hanggang ngayon ni. No, 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 no. It doesn't even. I mean, I think. I you probably lost that paper. And you know, I, I could have asked my cousin, you know, to, to help yes. me or whatever, but I was scared and plus like sabi ng parents ko na no, they said finish college first. So okay. it was my intention to finish college and then f- go back home. Go back right. home and, and you know pursue it. But I met Michael, my Michael. Mm. And sabi niya na he doesn't believe in long distance relationships. So oh. yo, and I chose him na lang and I chose Tama teaching. Naman. Tama Tama naman. Naman. Oh, everything worked out for the best. Yeah. 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 Okay, so you chose him. Yeah. And he knew that you wanted to go back to pursue an acting career or maybe Try your luck Entertainment. Acting, yeah. yeah, yeah. But he knew about the little girl na mm-hmm. nagbi mimic mimic ng. Yeah, yeah. He knew. He knew. Okay, so finally, you professional ka na, professional na siya. Mm-hmm. 
how did the acting bug find you and bite you? Okay. So, yung kaibigan ko, si Sheila. Hi, Sheila! <laughs> Sheila contacted me. Uh, she's a friend uh, from, from college, from the past. And she was asking me if I knew of a baby for that horror film. Right. And I said, yeah, yeah, sure. So, I contacted my friend who just had a baby like oh three God. months ago. <laughs> <laughs> Talent scout. <laughs> so I connected them. That was the the baby's mom, my my good friend Kristen. She said to Sheila, out of the blue, ha. Huh? She because Kristen knows, you know how how I love acting. I did a short film actually in college, but then mm. so she knows. So she said to Sheila, wouldn't it be cool if Noreen was the mom? Sabi niya ganun. Ganun, ganun, ganun lang. lang. Ganun, ganun lang. And, and Sheila was actually supposed to play the mom. Ouch. I know, pero she already had another project at the same time. So it worked out. And she was producing that film na. So she, and I'm a good friend of hers. So uh, yeah, she said, Noreen, I think you'd be better for this role talaga. You know, so she she gave it to me. And I mean, I had to audition. You know, I, I didn't right. just get it. I had to film myself and send it so to the director. So feeling? Was it accelerating? Um, I mean, to get the role. No, to actually just audition for the. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, it was a video lang, you know, like a. An Pero I game ka, you know, yeah, game ako, game ako. I mean, feeling yeah. na na itong batang to nag college, nagkaroon ng opportunity, nagasawa, pinakawala yung opportunity, and now it's right in front of her. That's you. So nung time na ito na mag audition ka na, did, did everything just come flooding back again? Na, oh my God, this is it. This is. It came flooding back. I mean, I a part of me kind of felt like, well, maybe I want even. I'm not even gonna get this role. You know what I mean? Because yeah, tagal tagal na. But um, it came <clears throat> back to me when I was actually on set. You know, and it was like, oh my gosh. You know, I I remember. I mean, I love I love this. And, right. But I was so scared because yeah, I haven't done it in so long. But everyone was so supportive, and it did really well. I hope you get to watch it one day. Sana. What's what's, what's the title? Lullaby, pero I think they're gonna change it. I think they're changing the title. Uh, wow. First, I forgot kung ano. But I'll let y'all keep you posted. Uh. Okay, we wanna watch. <laughs> Para lagi natin sa link dito sa sa description. Malaga lagi tayo ng link sa description. Uh, Now, mm-hmm. not only do you act, mm-hmm. you also sing. For fun. <laughs> My God, for <laughs> fun. Hindi ako ano. I'm not like Jamie na talagang professional. You know. <laughs> But okay, we worked together sa concert ng Intro Voice at saka ni Morissette. Mm-hmm. And um, that's where I met you. Yes. Tapos sabi ko, okay, itong si Jamie at si Noreen ang magbabackup. And you guys just showed up. And you guys did a great job backing up Morissette and Intro Voice nung, nung gabi yun. That was so much fun. It, It was. so much fun. It was. Mm-hmm. Now, now how'd you get into, lahat ba kayo magkakapatid, all four of you, you guys sing? Mahilig, mahilig na choir ka din. <laughs> mahilig sila kumanta pero ako lang yung talagang uh, you know, that really pursued it. Alam mo, okay. okay. Here's another story. Yeah, tell Alam, me stories. Madaldala ko no, no, no. <laughs> morning you. <laughs> Nung grade 1 na grade 1 ako sa STC, I went to St. Teresa's College. Okay. Uh, yung music teacher ko sabi bosses po sa ako. So, uh, kung bosses po sa ten, tenor ba tao, tenor ba tao ng alto or <laughs> <laughs> But because of that, I think I was like, you know, I'll show her. You know what I mean? The, na I did, ka. Yeah, the parang I'm not gonna let her stop my love for singing. So how do you say it? I'm not gonna let her stop my love for singing. You mean singing. a man say? Yeah. <laughs> Get up, <huh? laughs> You're not the boss of me. <laughs> And they're more pouty, like, <laughs> like a pain, like, I'll show oh. her. I'll show her. Meow. Meow, meow. Mato pa ako. It's hot here. Lakas ako na yung AC, ha? Okay. Ayun na yun. So, I joined choir. Mahili ko matay mga kapatid ko. Pero, I'm the only one that's really like, you know, did it a lot. Like, I, I joined choir sa so UCI din. And, You know, I just loved it. Church choir mostly, but um, but but dun talaga nahahasa lahat eh. I mean, it's the daily activity or the weekly activity na hindi mo napapansin that moves the needle forward without yeah. any effort eh. Yeah, yeah. Diba? Yeah. So, yung part na yon, did you have to force yourself to sing sa choir or is was that something you looked forward to every week? No, I looked forward to it. Yeah, I really loved it. 
Tapos sinama ko na din si ate. <laughs> so, sa arts talaga, mahilig ka talaga. I, I do, and I wish na, you know, sana I, I took more classes or I really immersed myself in it. I think it's just in there, in me. You know? Right. Yeah, but I, I didn't really... I know. Eh. Parang, I mean, I'm glad I did the choir stuff, yes. but you know, I didn't really take the singing lessons and all of that. Na talagang, you know, to, okay. to push myself. But it's just a passion. Wow. Anyway, we'll be back. Ah, mag- 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 short break lang tayo. When we come back, susuri natin yung word na passion na yan. Kung ano ang ano ang definition ni Miss Noreen Lani sa word na passion. <laughs> After this message. And we're back with Miss Noreen Lani. Okay, passion. Pinag-uusapan natin yon. Mm-hmm. Ang passion, ano yan eh? Mapusok yan eh, which means may gigil. If you're passionate about something, you really are gung-ho about something. And normally, what comes with passion is instant gratification. You want that right away or something, but you were able to delay gratification eh. And not everybody can do that. You know, like, maybe, yeah, entertainment and the arts is a passion, but you were also passionate with your husband. Mm-hmm. You were also passionate with your academics and all that. Explain that to us. What was going through your head? And I'll tell you why I want you to explain it. Huh? Mm-hmm. I'm passionate about music. My parents wanted me to go to school. I did not want to go to school. Mm-hmm. So, ang ginawa ko, binaksak ko yung buong college ko para... Eh, to pursue. Yeah. I'm sorry, mom and dad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wala akong choice. Kailangan akong mag-music. Something like that. But you, you were obedient. Sinet aside mo yung sayo. Mm-hmm. Yung Johnny Manahan mo. I would have missed, I would have missed my, my flight for that. Pag sinabi ni Mr. M na, oh, baka gusto ka kausapin ni Mr. M, I would have missed my flight sa word na baka. I didn't know mm. eh. You know, I, I didn't know the depth of it. If I know now who, you know, if I yeah. know now what I knew. If, if, you if know, I know, if I knew. If you knew then. <laughs> if you knew then. If I knew then, what do you know now? Ano ba yan? Yeah. Ayun, I, things might be different. But okay. Yeah, yeah. So, how, but how were you able to delay gratification? Um, well, I guess nung sinabi ng parents ko na, you know, college muna. Kasi sabi ng mami ko, it's always nice to have something to fall back on. And naniwala ka naman doon. <laughs> Oh, and a man. Kasi ang kapalit nun is, with something to fall back on, you never really go 100% on the one thing you want to pursue. Yeah. Because you have something to fall back on. I know, I know. Um, I think kasi, like, I'm very cautious. Like, I'm not mm. one to just, you know, I yeah. mean, I admire you for your, you know, passion in that sense risky. that you're willing Very yeah, risky, I'm not I'm not right. really that much of a risk taker so um, and, and she teaching was my second love so you know parang okay lang you know I love kids and I want to make a difference as cliche as cliche as that sounds like I really wanted to make you know a positive difference in the world in my own way and so I felt like okay lang and saka bait bait ni Michael you really have yes. to weigh it you know what I mean like you really have to like hindi mo ang sarili mo I mean this is Teaching is my second love. At saka mabait naman si Michael. <laughs> Di ba? Parang, parang, ano ito is? I mean, Okay, ngayon, I mean. Um, okay. I didn't want to like disappoint anyone. You know? Yes. I'd rather, I, I, I'd rather be the one na yun nga, masaktan. So, yun. So, you'll, you'll sacrifice yourself yeah. and your happiness for the good of everybody else around you. Yeah, yeah. And hopefully that brought you joy. Or it did naman. Yeah, of course. Okay, take note. Ha, because happiness is temporary. Eh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Joy is permanent. Oh, I like that. Okay. Pwede ka maging malungkot and still be joyful and yeah, be at be peace. Grateful. And yeah, be grateful. Be grateful, di ba? Yeah, for sure. Happiness, ano lang yan, emotion. Joy is a state. Eh. Uh-huh. Kung ganun, eh. Yeah, yeah. No, I... I, I I mean, looking back, I definitely think that I, I made the right choice. I think you did, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. it's all coming back to you now. Yeah, 
God, I'm so grateful like for any opportunity. Kahit na wala man, you know, wala na, na dumating, like I can just look back and say, wow, I did this and this and thank you, God. <laughs> you right, know? right, right. I'm just super grateful. Let's talk about gratefulness because not everybody has that. You know, everybody, like ngayon, nowadays, people are so entitled. Hmm. And kaya ang daming depressed na tao because they feel so entitled and then hindi dumarating sa buhay nila yung iniisip nilang para sa kanila. Mm-hmm. How did gratefulness come to your life? I think my mom, my mom <clears throat> always taught us, you know, to be thankful and grateful for Counting whatever, blessing, whatever we had. Yeah, yeah. Kasi like, you know, we grew up with Uh, not that much. I mean, okay lang kami. Okay lang naman kami. My parents worked for Philippine Airlines. Tapos... Eh, talagang okay nga kayo. Isipin mo, <laughs> libre <laughs> flight yun. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was the best thing. Yeah, Tapos yeah. hindi mo pa minis yung flight para makipag-meeting kay Mr. M. <laughs> hindi kasi, the, like, I had to get back Babalik then to get ready talaga. to get ready for college. Like, school was gonna start na. That was in August yata. Or At nag-promise ka kay Michael na, mag- mag- na magkikita kayo sa for that enrollment. Hindi pa kami, ah, hindi pa, hindi pa kami okay. noon. Oo, okay, okay. pero um, ano nga yung question mo? <laughs> A question, question ko is yung gratefulness. Ay, mo. Ay, 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 And ay. then you said your mom, your parents oh, yes, worked yes. for Philippine okay, okay. Airlines. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, we were okay naman. Like, you know, I, I, pero, you know, it's not like we grew up very wealthy. And when we moved here, my dad had to start, he retired na from from engineering there. Pero he had to start all over at the age of 60. And he, yeah, at the age Galing, of 60, no? tapos uh, mama ko din, you know, they had a hard time finding a job and, you know, we had a small house, mm. pero my mama always said na, alam mo, we're not, we may not be rich in money, pero we're rich in love. So, so intact yung family. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then, isa-isa kayo naglabasan sa nest. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Galing. <laughs> alam mo, I was supposed to work for Philippine Airlines. I ah, really? Bakit hindi mo ginawa? At sin, munti ka na kasi walang nangyayari sa intro voice. Mm-hmm. And may long, long hair pa ako nun. Sabi ng production manager namin, tara mag, per, mag ano lang tayo, mag FA na lang tayo. So, oh, nag, okay. nagpagupit na kami ng buhok. Yeah, yeah. Talaga ready na kami to go to Cebu kasi doon ang training eh. Okay. Like, two weeks prior to going to Cebu, biglang nag number one yung kanta ng intro voice. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I know. But you know, like I was like, oh my god, I was about to yeah. have free tickets and all. So sama din si JJ. Say sa card, coffee tea or me. Sayang. Okay, let's talk about your love story, okay. si Michael. <laughs> yes. Paano kaya nagmeet? Sa college, okay, sa UCI. Now, mm-hmm. now, si Michael is not Filipino. Mm-hmm, puti, yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh-huh. Is that your type? <laughs> no, actually, akala ko talaga you like, Filipino. Yeah. Filipino guy. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Alam mo, yung type ko noon, yung mga mahilig sa mga banda, like that, like, really? you know, yung nagchichinelas. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Nagtatagalog, okay. mga yeah, gano'n. Yeah, 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 yeah. But um, yeah, I, I no, I never thought, never ever ever. But um, I don't know. God just put us together, which so, is good. And you've been blessed with a good family now. Yeah. Ang tanong dito is, nung nagliligawang kayo ni Michael, did you ask him what he wanted or what he, what he was passionate about? Um, baka naman hindi like in those words, but you know, we we, we got to know each other. Oh, so really what's he well. passionate about? <laughs> He really, really loves sports. But, okay, Michael, I hope you're watching. I will talk in English. <laughs> no, I know, I, well, like he he used to really, really love sports. He was very athletic back then, okay. and so you did talk about that. Like you know, if you could be whatever you wanted to be, you know, what would you have been? A what? And Anisha, like professional athlete, though. Like you know, well, maybe not safe baseball. No professional athlete. <laughs> Baseball, profession? baseball. Okay. Uh, uh, um, he plays basketball then in volleyball. Mat- matangka siya, he's 6'5". Wow. Yeah. So, um, yun ang passion niya. But, uh, you know, I mean, he he made his choice too. Like, right. he didn't pursue. Yeah. Because did you stop him from pursuing Ay, his... Ay, No, 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 no. He, he decided to, like, really focus on academics. Like, uh-huh. nung, ano na siya, like, when he entered UCI. Before, okay. prior to me. Uh-oh. Oh, wow. Now... <laughs> Did he ask you what you were passionate about? Oh, naman. Yeah, and he knew. Like, he knew. Like, what I told you. Yung nagusta yes. ko to. So, finally, 
nung na nag-settle down na kayo after the proposal and having kids and all that and this came along, mm-hmm. what was the conversation like? Ito, itong like this opportunity. Yeah. Um, you know, he was really supportive. Like I, I know, just, but what how about how'd you break the ice? Hey, remember that? Okay, cause baby steps eh. Of course. <laughs> the reason why I'm asking is break it to me gently among couples. Sometimes pag magkahiwalay ng ng ano ng journey, mm-hmm. nakakaroon ng ano yan, eh, ng riff or miscommunication, eh, diba? Mm-hmm. So you have to really lay it down. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so before the acting stuff happened, I was actually given the opportunity to do hosting for a friend's uh, YouTube Pacific Rim video, see si Peter Gonzaga. Oh, so, Pacific, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's Peter, okay. Mm-hmm. So I started to do that first. How'd you, how'd you yeah. talk to Michael about it? Um, sabi ko lang sa kanya na, oh, you know, because my, my friend Stanley recommended me kay Peter. And I said, hey, you know, Stanley um, said, you know, do I want to do like some hosting for Peter? Like on the side, like for fun lang. Wala namang bayad yun. I mean, well, later on, like, you know, if we did GMA stuff, there was. But for the most part, it was for fun or to get in free sa yes. concerts and all of that. Yes. But, you know, it was so much fun and it made me feel alive and um, when it when the opportunity came, so we go, hey, you know, I really want to try this. Can I? Bakit ka natatawa? Because it's a pitch, di ba? It's a pitch. You're selling it to your husband. <laughs> <laughs> so, hindi imagine ko lang kung baba, kung hiritan ako ni Jaja ng ganun. Baby! Eh? <laughs> Gusto ko na malaman kung ano magiging reaction ko. Pag- <laughs> well, you know, I, kasi, <sighs> okay, being married and having four kids and you know it, it takes a toll on you then eh? of course like, you routine. Know, and, and teaching full time yes and, you know so with more kids yeah yeah, right? yeah and um and then also like when this happened it was like a couple years after my mom our mom passed away i'm sorry to hear and that, so yeah. yeah it was really a tough time for me like i i went through some really you know dark lonely sad times and you know nakaka depressed diba and <sighs> so uh when this came up it was like it brought me back to life yung parang ganon so nakita niya how happy i was and so yun he was supportive of that and so mm. whenever peter ha- needed me for something mostly for the phil am stuff because he does like other yes. events yes. um yun nag ano ko sa red carpet ng mga right. beauty pageant mm. or whatever or concert like uh i interviewed um like, Martin sa Philip Miss Philippine International yata yun. I know oh, yeah. you had yeah, yes. yeah, like things like that. So um yun tapos and then the acting came after that. No no no, we're not so, there yet. We're not there. Ay, yet. Okay. <laughs> we're, we're, okay. We're okay. We're talking about oh Peter called again. I have something going on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then syempre mag magtitwinkle lang yung mata mo sabi na naman ang asama. Okay. Uh-huh. Then uh, we can na naman ng late. Tapos oh hey, Peter called again. Ano naman yung sporadic naman, hindi naman like, you know, every single weekend. And actually, actually, pinag-usapan namin ito kasi sabi ko sa kanya na, you know, are you sure like you're okay? Is it bothering you? Yeah. yeah, 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 of course. Si, so, importante yan eh. Yeah, yeah. To, to not assume mm-hmm. that it's always okay. Yeah, yeah. Diba? No, we talk about it. He's okay, really, good. he's a very good communicator. And um, we've talked about it. And actually, alam mo, sinabi niya. <laughs> Kasi, nung, nung nadidepress ako, you know, like, my doctor said, oh, work out, so you get yes. endorphins, you know, and yeah, all yeah, that. Yeah. So, I would go, like, three times a week with my best friends to gym. And, right. you know, when you go to the gym, like, you know, syempre, you go there, tapos, you know, you take a class or whatever, yes. and you do other stuff after that. Yes. And by the time, like, I'm back, it's, like, three hours later. Right. And then, you know, times three times a week or four times a week, so, whatever. Tagal-tagal away from home. Yeah. yeah. And so, sabi niya sa akin na, you know, I actually like you doing like the stuff with Peter rather than you going to the gym. <laughs> Kasi nga, it's, yeah. it's, it adds up. It yes. adds up. And, um, so yun, okay naman siya. Kasi nga, paminsan-minsan lang naman to. Like, you know, I don't know, once a month, once every two months. I don't know. It just depends. Okay. And then now, uh, the acting thing came in. Tapos, ngayon may show ka. You have a, you have a weekly... Oh, it's show. not weekly actually. Well, is the it show monthly? the show is weekly pero monthly yung BFF. Yeah. Okay, monthly yeah. taping. Uh 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 how did you talk about uh that show with your husband? Um I I, I told I told him about it from the very beginning pa and he was like, "Do you want to, you know, do you want to go for it? Do you want to try try it out?" And um cuz I heard about it from my friend uh from it's my friend's husband told me about I uh, <laughs> audition, <laughs> and so uh, wait, you had to you had to audition for that. Actually, hindi naman audition, pero uh, I he asked me for uh, 
my clips of okay. interviewing people. Yeah. I gave him my website then. So okay. yun, uh, um, si Lou, Lou saw it yes. and she liked me. So um, I yun. love Lou. I know, I know. Me Alam too. Ba, yeah. She actually came here nung Pasko. Ah, she did. Personally. Yeah. To bring me one, one tray of food for the gods. Because you remember the taping that then? Yeah, you loved it. Yeah. She gave me one, ayak, hindi ka labutan, one whole tray. <laughs> Ang bait. Yes. Oh, that's so, she's very sobrang, thoughtful. Sobrang, wow. Yeah. yeah, that's so kind. Oh. Alam ko na kung bakit. Bakit? Ayaw niya mag-guest eh. <laughs> <laughs> that was Luha, her. <laughs> hindi ka fair ha. Kala mo mabibili mo ako ng food for the gods. <laughs> No, she's very nice. She's very thoughtful. Yeah. Very she nice. thought about that whole thing. Uh-oh. Bigyan ko na ng food for the gods ng tao to mananahimik to. <laughs> uh, that was so nice of her to do that. I know, oh. right? So you do, you're do. you doing BFF. Tell us about BFF. What is it about? So um, BFF is a show. It's actually a segment from uh, Spotlight TV. It's so Channel 18. And, you know, we spotlight like uh, people in the Filipino-American community. For, for a minute, right? Like two minutes. <laughs> Three. <laughs> <laughs> Depending. <laughs> but, uh, it's yeah. on spotlight. <laughs> I think it seems like we only have like 10 minutes to the I know. show You're or right. something like that. Yeah. yeah. So, ano lang naman, uh, Michael, my, Michael was, uh, was okay with it because it's just monthly. And, yes. you know, and because of COVID, like we didn't even get to meet last month. And, oh. yeah, yeah. So, um, okay naman siya. And he knows that it brings, you know, me joy then. So, yun. Mahal na mahal ka na asawa mo, ha? Mahal? Oo, bait. Napakabait. Alam mo, kasi ano niya ako, first and only girlfriend oh. ever. Yeah. So, I'm really thankful. That's that's nice, diba? I know. Alam mo yung feeling na, ano, na kayong dalawa, how important is give and take and trust in a relationship? Napaka, siyempre, di ba? Ikaw ba, are you giving? Oo naman. Really? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Ite-test kita. Okay. Ah, naku po. It's just okay. a quiz. <laughs> Miki quiz kita. Okay. Oh. Sinabi ni Michael na, I'm gonna coach uh, a kid's basketball team. He does coach, pero soccer. Okay. Mm. So how many times a week? Uh, COVID ngayon eh, pero dati it was like three times. Wait. It will, twice a week yung practice, tapos yung games sa weekend. So. Do you attend? Yung practice? Yes. No. How about the games? Well, apat kasi anak namin is we have to split. So oh. he'll take, you know, uh, when he's with the other kids, I'm with the other kids at their games. <clears throat> so the, ito, ito pa another thing, no? Does he come with you to your shootings or events? Sa ano, pag, like, like he was there sa Intro Voice Morissette concert. Yes. Oh, he was there. Uh, pag, pag yung ganun, like the film festivals, mm, yeah. if our show, if yes. our movie showing, nandun siya. Uh-oh. If he can make it sa concert. Did you know, I sang uh, sa front act ni Geneva. Saan? Yeah! Uh, at a restaurant. San ba yun? I forgot the name of the restaurant. Wait, so was, talagang, Talaga nag for front act front act ka na. Oy, hindi. <laughs> Actually, oh my gosh. Okay, so Okay. And now I mean I'm intrigued. Kwento. Okay. Wait, teka, ano yung quiz mo? Ayun na yung quiz mo tapos na yung hindi, quiz hindi, mo. Hindi. About... Talo na ako sa quiz ko eh. Ilan ilan sa isang linggo yan. Swerte ni Michael. Okay, go. Oh. Uh, okay, so yung mga front act front act na yun, it's because of my friend Garth. At saka yeah. si Jamie din. Jamie got me into yes. that thing. And that was a last minute thing, by the way. I only found out I was gonna do it like two days before your concert. <laughs> so Kaling, no? Oh, it was so fun. Pero hindi, hindi talaga ako... I'm telling you, it's just for fun, nga, pero I have nice friends that think of me. So, and I think, you know, you, you know what, it, it, this is, this is uh, no, what's nice, you know. You're having fun. Mm-hmm. But the reality is, it should start with you having fun. Mm-hmm. And yeah. then everything else follows. Eh. Yeah, yeah. Kaya nga, ang So let's talk about this. So, si Garth, okay, ngayon pinagtutugma ko na si Garth, I encouraged the guy to start his own production. He you fight, did? Yeah, remember during the that that concert yeah oh that my Morissette gosh that Morissette Intro Voice concert sabi ko sa kanya why don't you start your own production I remember that conversation now oh and my then gosh. he produced the whole Geneva thing oh dun pala nag stem yun yeah, okay, so, okay okay so ang nangyari na yun yeah and then front act ka ano nangyari walang follow through aren't you gonna pursue a singing career para <laughs> eh sabi ko nga sa'yo hindi naman talaga ako yung I mean 
I don't think I'm like as as good as like Garth or Jamie or basta. I'm not as good as Garth or Jamie. Hello, eh, pero ano ka no? Like you're you're so talented with so kita many mo, ways. Kita mo, kita like, mo, kita mo. Sinabi ko I'm not good as Garth or Jamie. Ibig sabihin, singer yung dalawang yun. Tapos sabi niya, eh, magaling ka nga mag, mag ganun ganun. So ibig sabihin, inaamin niya nga na, oh, totoo pa ako, hindi ka talaga kumakanta, mag drums ka na lang. <laughs> But I mean, It's it's all like you know encompassing. Sige, try to get out of that. Sige, no. sige. <laughs> Hindi musician uh, ka talaga, musician ka talaga. Mo, ako, musician. Ako gusto mong singer. You are. That includes mi- it. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's included with it. No, what oh, I mean, God. I mean seriously. Andito ka ni. What's holding you back? How old is your youngest? He's five. five. Okay, now I know what's holding you back. <laughs> <laughs> No, happy na ako sa mga ginagawa ko. I don't know what you mean. Like, pursue it how? Like, make like, an really? album? Or yeah. Put something out on Spotify. You've done it already. You're on Amazon. Why not be on Spotify? Why not create a legacy that your kids and grandkids can appreciate? Diba? Inisip ko lang. Ewan ko. Eh, we'll see. <laughs> so what's holding you back? I don't think I'm that good, you know. So I you're holding you back? Yeah, I guess oh. so. I have to work on that. I palagi ko tina touch to. I know lang. I I guess like I I uh, I struggle with that. Like thinking I'm not good enough. Imparang ganon. Ano to na giging therapy to? Who plays that in your head? Again, ah, this is so nice because people watching this are gonna go. Oh my God! Akala ko lang. Akala ko ako lang nakakaisip ng ganon. And then there's you, who's actually. You know, they can relate. Somebody they can relate to, and and this is why we're pulling everybody out of from be sitting on the fence, diba? Like you, you're sitting on the fence right now. Na, are you holding yourself back? Wait, is it that's the question? Yeah, <laughs> from pursuing, diba? From taking the next step, like front. I mean, na. yes, I guess I am. I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pero, okay. hey, I'm taking steps. Be proud of me. Oh, tell me, what are the steps? Well, like, well, not for singing, pero for acting. Like, I joined an acting class na, you know, to get me out. Kasi I'm so comfortable in our Filipino community. Right. Uh, pero, I don't know, Randy was trying to, like, encourage me to venture out. Tsaka si Ina, Ina, mm, you know, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, she yeah, does yeah. so many things. So, yeah. to me, that was a huge, huge step, like, you know, to join, like, this acting. It just started last week. Pero, Workshop. Yeah, it's a workshop. Yeah. So would you do kissing scenes? Hindi yata ayoko. So he, hindi yata ayoko. Pero wala ng definite answer talaga, no? So, Forehead. Wala, paano pag dumating sa ganon? An opportunity comes. How? What's the conversation like with your husband? Pinag-usapan na namin yung sabi really? sa kanya. Yeah, uh, I was like, how? What? What if they paid me like a million dollars? Like if I had, you know, like. What's What's the lowest they would they would have to pay you for a kissing scene? Ayaw niya, ayaw niya talaga. Sabi Good niyo, job. I don't care. Sabi niya, uh, <laughs> it's not an adult. That's admirable. <laughs> Yeah, ayaw niya talaga. Ayaw okay lang sa'yo na ayaw niya. Eh, pero nung tinurn ko, ah, sabi ko, okay, well, what if they said, like, you know, what if you had to kiss, like, Jessica Alba for, like, a million dollars? Of course. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, ayun, I don't ah, know. Ah, sa sabi ko kay Jaja, ikaw, pumamili ka na rin kung gusto, sino gusto mong i-kiss. Papayagan mo si Jaja? Ikaw may Jessica Alba. <laughs> Ah, dapat may ano. <laughs> Meron ka rin. Oh, okay, okay. Di ba? Alagay, oh. nanonood lang ako. Ganun, parang hindi yata tama yun. <laughs> dapat equal. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> but anong ending ng conversation niyo? About? About, um, you know, get yung, yung where do you guys draw the line? Ah, uh, no, he's, he's not, you know, comfortable. At saka ko din, like, you know, I, I don't want, like, love scenes or kissing And this is very important, right? Mm-hmm. Because yeah, yeah. Because dapat alam din ng um if you if you have an agent, dapat alam ng agent to. If you have a an in the producer or, or or a director, dapat Yeah. You know, alam din ano yung boundaries. Yeah. Hindi yung hinahanap ka na nila tapos yung bawal to, bawal to, bawal to. Yeah, yeah. Yun. So Correct. Okay, when we'll be back ha? when we come back, we'll talk more about oh my god, anong mga ano ang mga perks at anong mga hindi perks ng pagiging indie artist after this? All right, and we're back. Okay, Noreen. Yes. Let's talk about being on set. Okay. So, people think, you know, it's a full production and uh, may mga catering, may craft na catering, may mga ano-ano mga ganon, right? But you mentioned a while ago, yung huling movie nyo, 
Perfect Strangers, total indie, not to the point your kids were your director of photography and all that stuff. Yeah. So how does it work? How does it work being in a short film, na, na DIY? Mm-hmm. Well, um, I mean, see, Anna, the director, was the one that did all the hard things. All we had to do was shoot. So, see, Anna, ka FaceTime ko siya. So she was, you know, on the phone with the FaceTime. Right. That was prior to like filming. You know, we had to. I mean, memorize the script and talk yeah. about all the props that we needed. Kami kami mismo ni Randy na okay. Ano ko ni mo? Ano bibilin mo? Ano to? Yes. Ano why natin? Ano you know? So um, ayun, like I I mean, it's so much work. It's so much work. I nung dati before doing this stuff, I thought na oh dali dali lang yan. Pero oh my gosh, like you take this shot, you take this shot, you take this shot. Okay, you know let's talk I mean? about so much work. So in other words, si Anna wasn't physically where you are. No, where you were. no, 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 no. Yeah. So, so FaceTime lang siya and she yeah. was directing remotely. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's interesting. Okay. So yeah. anong, how will she relay the the scene to you and the 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 shots? Papani yo, papani communication yo. So, ano lang, puro FaceTime, text, FaceTime, text, yeah. So, we had like, you know, multiple phones kasi actually, ginagamit lang nung, ano ko, ng daughter ko, yung my phone. And right. so, I was using my daughter's phone or my husband's phone uh, to have Anna there. Like, she's there. Yes. Like, wherever my daughter is, may, nandun yung phone. So, nakikita ni Anna ko na nangyari. Parang ganun. Correct. Okay. Yeah. But, yun. Ang galit. Hindi, hindi, wag mo, anong yun? Keep talking because, <laughs> because, nakakatawa. And the reason why, ito yung part na kapag gusto may paraan, mm-hmm. kapag ayaw, lagi may dahilan. I mean, you guys were able to make something out of technology that's readily available to yeah, everybody. I know. Yeah, it was so, really cool. Uh-oh. Talk more about it. Like, okay, ano, anong start? Anong now, scene now, ngayon gusto ko talaga panoorin because based on what you're telling us right now, yeah, this is very intriguing and interesting. When you did it this way, did it ever occur to you na, Legit pa tong ginagawa ko? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I thought na, you know, kasi nga, uh, like, we were just under the impression that, okay, you know, we're just gonna put it sa YouTube, you know, right, for right, everyone. Right. Kasi it had something to do with uh, what was happening now. Like, yes. with quarantine and everything. And so, um, parang fun project lang talaga. Di ko yeah. kalain na, you know, sasubmit ni Anna sa Prime Video. And then, and then <laughs> it will be, a, submit, yeah, mm-hmm. it will be accepted into you that. You know, if you type your so, name on Prime, everything comes out, right? I didn't. I didn't try. But yeah, and na, and na, and um, yeah. So so when she told us about the idea, it was just like something fun to do, and you know, from the script and it, just just getting ideas on like how oh, okay, because madali naman yung ano um yung scenes because it's like me acting like me or yes. Randy acting like him. Parang yeah. I mean pretending single lang. Of so yeah, but you know, it, having my kids involved was a lot of fun because now they want to do it too. So, I mean, it was a lot of work for them then, but they had to uh, make sure na you know they had the right shot or oh, pati yung ano you like I had there's a part that I'm like tapping the alarm clock. Oh my gosh! Like even focusing on the the, the ano and making sure like my reflections not there. Yung mga ganon, uh, every little detail. Uh, my kids helped me out with. Um, making sure that everything was cleared the area, uh, making sure na pareho yung buho ko as it was the last time that we yeah. did it. Yeah, yung damit. Yes. Um, shopping for that, like making sure na Randy and I matched with um, what we were kind of wearing or ko ano yung, I don't know, like what our rooms right, look like right, right, and all right. of that. But um, it it was a lot of fun. I, I Ano pa ba ginawa namin? So every time that we shot it, we would text it to her. So actually, there's a part sa movie na on my end. I don't know why. Maybe it was like the I don't know what happened. Pero measure a little bit blurry for for my wait. My ano scene, medium? But, Were you using uh, a phone? Or? iPhone, iPhone lang. IPhone. Everything was iPhone. Everything was iPhone. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So people really don't have any excuse not to be able to do short films, palatalaga. Yeah. Talaga. Yeah. I mean, they can do it as long as you know they. You know, I divide like if you, if if you're willing to um, try it out, like you find a way, right? Yes. Yeah. So, ano lesson ang natutunan mo rito? Na something fun can also turn out to be something great, you know? Because now it's yeah. immortalized. Eh. If it's on Prime, it's in their database. Anjan na yan eh. Yeah. Nasa repository yeah. na nila yon. Oh. Yeah, na, it, it means something can start off, you know, like yeah. a fun project lang and mm-hmm. you don't know where it could end up. Are you planning uh, to do more of this? Yung short films? Yeah. Or, 
Yeah, yeah. I would like to. Actually, may meron kami nga schedule ni, ni Randy uh, to be filmed in May. So, um, Short na naman, 10 minutes ulit. Yeah, pero hindi ito Phil M community. It's like, you know, uh, yeah, it's multicultural. So, okay. Yeah. It's my first time like on a set like that na hindi Filipino yung... Hindi rin iPhone to. No, no, no. It's like a real, yeah, the real deal. So, yeah, I'm excited about that. Siyempre, nerv- nervous. <laughs> Galing But, yan, no? Yeah. Do you get paid doing this? Um, some, yes. Some, no. So, yung kay, this, yung The Perfect Strangers, no, we didn't. Okay. We didn't. Kasi it was just like a fun, you know, fun right. project. And understood na namin yun, ni Randy. Right. Uh, my, my narration part, yes, it was paid. Um, yung other ones, uh, some were, like yung kaina, that one was, I don't think I can talk to you about that. No. That one husband couldn't see Randy but I, I I get sick in that one so that was a really dramatic one um, but yeah that one was more like uh, may binigay sila na gifts sa amin depende kasi mga student films a lot of them yes. are like student films so it just depends on what it is like and commercials that I've done I've also done voiceover stuff and so yung mga my, my budget you know like the tobacco free CA yung Department of Public Health syempre may bayad yeah. you know but um, like uh, Yung friend ko na, she does like eyelashes. Nag-trade kami. You know, it's like bartering. So, Sean, okay. So, you'll <laughs> you know? do the, um, you'll do the advertising. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pero pa lashes. <laughs> yeah, parang ganun. Like, so, you know, depende, di ba? Like, uh, if it's you with your friends, you you work it out. Yes. But, um, yung, I did like a mental health one sa TFC and that one was paid. So, it varies. Yeah. Ito pa. Um, I should know because my wife speaks fluent Tagalog and ah. her English is good, like yours. Pero at eight years old, pa paano hindi na wala ang Tagalog sa Kasi Tagalog sa bahay, Tagalog sa bahay. Tsaka, I remember because Philippine Airlines, you know, yeah. we would often go back and forth like every year or every other year. And I remember going back nung 10 years old ako, at saka na ako. You know, oh. like I remember talking to like my cousins. I was natinatawanan nila ako nat- natatawa sila kasi nga nabubulol ako right. and so after that I made it a point na oh I'm never gonna forget Tagalog parang ganun yun okay now hindi mo nakalimutan ng Tagalog dahil si Michael is not Filipino hindi mo pinursu sa mga anak mo ayun na nga eh. I tried in the beginning pero nahirapan ako I know I should have I is should it have important? Just- Oh, to be bilingual? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I regret, you know, not... I mean, I guess I still could with my son. Pero hindi na kasi sila interesado talaga. So, it's just harder. Well, but, none of your kids want to be an actor? They do. They do then. Yeah. They, uh, yung, the oldest one is kind of like indifferent. The second one, she actually, she likes more like the direct. Behind the scene, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Pero, I mean, they're interested if they... Uh, may cameo sila eh, dun sa the one I narrated. Oh. Yeah. So they they got a little taste of it and yeah. They, What if Mr. M calls you? <laughs> Now? <laughs> It's so ano na, Mr. M, hello. <laughs> no, I, I mean, what do you mean? Like now? <laughs> yeah. Paano yun? Ay, wako, ikaw kaya tinatanong kita eh. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Lana, you doesn't even know me. But no, if but he, he, paano nga? Paano? Okay. What if? What if? Uh, biglang si Diet, biglang nag-email sa'yo ngayon at sinabing, uh, Hey, naalala mo some 10, 20 years ago na gato, ganyan, 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 ganyan. Oh. Uh, Gusto ka pa rin makausap ni Mr. M. <laughs> Especially now na ang ABS-CBN is... Venturing out. Oo. Oh. Uh-huh. Sure. Pero Philippine Why, based ka. Huh? Ay, lilipat ako doon. Yes. Uh, how about ano na lang, compromise. <laughs> Mr. Emil. Mr. Emil wala compromise yun, eh. it's either your ano yun eh. Nako po. Ay, kasi may family na, paano yun? You know. Sige nga, so so let's 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 go to that hypothetical crossroad, no? Mm-hmm. What would you tell Someone like Johnny Manahan, who at a snap of a finger can change the trajectory of your career. And here you are with four kids ranging from 14 
to five, ang pinaka young guest. Yeah. And a husband who has a career here. And you, who has a life here. Mm-hmm. Bigla siyang naglabas ng proposal at saka offer. Can it just be like a movie? <laughs> and I had an offer to bring the whole family to the Philippines, huh? Of course, for your youth, for you to pursue this. Pina, yeah, pinadadali ko na. Ah, uh, maybe we could try it out. <laughs> how, how, what would the conversation be with Michael like? Um. And by the way, the reason why I'm, I'm asking you, this happens in real life, by the way. Yung mga ganon, yung mga... Yung mga life change na buong family affected. Yeah. Remember, all these years, ang pinagbigyan mo is lahat ng tao. Yeah. So ngayon, at your age of 31. 31? <laughs> <laughs> bilang, bilang, bilang ngayon, ito yung opportunity nilalatag na sa lap mo ng ganyan. Yeah. Ano yeah? <laughs> Ko ano gagawin ko? Of course. Po, po. I mean, Kita mo yung dalawa so sa likod ng camera, interesadong just, malaman, no? This is so hard. It's so hard. I mean, syempre, you know, I have to talk about it with my husband. I know, I know, like the, the, the thing to do is to, you know, don't let it go again, di ba? Grab at the chance ulit. I'm not, I'm not, ano, I'm not gonna say yes or no to you. Or I want to, uh, me and the audience, <laughs> we want to see what your squirmish reaction would be and how you'd navigate this because baka may mapulot kami. Because see, it's just how I am. Like it's it's not about me still, you know. It's my family, so I I can't like I don't. I mean, sending a my movie and it could be a summer project or right. I can work it out. Like you know, you'll have to uh, really uproot yourself and move back to the Philippines. Because yeah. you'll be starting a career there, yeah. Right? You groom kanila, you set kanila sa mga roles. Sa syempre, all year round na yung scheduling nun and yeah. all that. Yeah. Maybe it when I'm retired now. <laughs> you know, that's a good attitude, no? So, ang, tinati- ang, ang gusto ko makita sa'yo kasi is hanggang sa'yo yung delayed gratification mo. Eh. Ayan, yung pagsinay mo, maybe when I'm retired na. So, you're willing to go that extra mile. Yeah, why not? I don't, Total, I don't wanna... mo na rin lang ng ganito katagal, <laughs> Happy naman ako eh. Alam mo pa ako, I'm so happy like with what I'm doing. You know, like I feel, I, I feel super grateful na I can, I can balance it all out. And kahit na, you know, like these are indie films and yes. some I get paid, some I don't. Yes. You know, the hosting, the hosting yes. like yeah, we get paid sa BFF pero like, you know, the other things I told you, some we get paid, some we don't. Yung mga ganun. Hindi naman yung kasi I'm doing it for like that, that uh, internal, you know, right. uh, satisfaction na, oh, this brings me so much joy and I'm doing what I love. And it's not about the money. I mean, that'd be nice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that would be super nice. Kung if it co- if it all comes together. But I'm thankful for my job. Na, you know, if I didn't have my job and everything was relying on you know acting and in singing and all of that, then lagot ako. You know, yes. Kasi, uh, you know, it's so hard. It's so hard when you like lay everything out on the table and you know you feel so vulnerable. Na oh my gosh, if I don't get this, how am I gonna feed my kids? You know, I. I I don't want it to end up like that. So, so sino si Noreen, Lani? Sino si Noreen? Ate, sino ba ako? <laughs> um, si Noreen ay... Ito, ay mo ko, ang hirap naman nun eh. Ikaw, take what do you take think? Take your time. No, no, no. Take your time. Si Noreen ay... Corny. <laughs> <laughs> Sinurin ay uh, mahilig tumawa. Pero sinurin ay ano din, sensitive. You know, I feel deeply. Um, ano pa ba? Ang hirap naman. Nun, ang deep naman ang question na yun eh. Kaya mo yan. We'll wait. Sino ba ako? <laughs> ano hirapan ako talaga pa ako? Ah... Uh, ano ba? It's okay to cry, ha? Huh? Hoy! <laughs> Wag naman! Oh, ikaw, ikaw muna. Ikaw hindi, muna. Sino si Paco? <laughs> okay na ako. Pero hindi, seriously. Because, I mean, you know, I'm looking at you and I'm looking through you which begs the question nga talaga, sino si Noreen? Because there's that Noreen that 
is presented to other people. And there's that nerdy na pag wala, pag tulog na lahat ng tao uh-huh. at pag mag-isa na lang siya lumalabas. So, you know where I'm going at with this, right? So, I see, no. take a deep breath. Yeah, you do. <laughs> what? So, sino-sino rin talaga? Oh, yan. Um, si Noreen ay isang Gemini. So I have very many different I know, sides of me. Mm. And different people see the different sides of me depending mm. on who you are in my life. Right. You know? Yes. So, so but sino talaga si Noreen? <laughs> well, Kasi na, na, dun nga tayo, kaya nga, okay, let's go through that and let's really peel the um, onion to... I think na I know I wear my heart on my sleeve a lot. Yes, so you it's, do. Yeah, it's it's pretty easy to see who I am. I think. But you're not answering the question. Emo ko nga kasi. Ano ba to? Ah, ate ano sino ba ako? Help! Help! Ano ba yung tawag do? I need a phone a friend. A phone a friend. Phone a sister. Ano ba yun ang hira? Taka eh. Like do, do, describe like what I like. Or Kita mo, wala to sa topic ideas mo. <laughs> I know. What the heck? <laughs> hey, Michael, sabi mo ha? Sabi mo, send topic ideas. Wala. Ala. Ano yung and, and, and you know why I'm asking you this question? Because I want our viewers to look at themselves in the mirror mm-hmm. and be able to ask themselves that question and actually have an answer to it because that's the first step to getting off the fence. Hoy. <laughs> That's deep, ha? Hala. I felt that. Ah, hoy, wag mo ko pa iyakin dito. <laughs> Di pwede. Oh my gosh. Lalala sa para AC. Um. What do you mean, nga? Hinginapan <laughs> ako. Give me an example na lang. Okay, go. Like, um, ayoko nga, ba't ako ang bibigay ng example? Mag-pass na lang tayo. Ipapass ko okay. na lang. Pass na lang. Pass. Sige, kasi hindi ko alam. I mean, it's hard to describe, you know, yourself. I don't know how, like, to what depth. Like, I don't know. Yes, you, you know. do. Ah. Alam mo, naiyakal na magsalita sa sarili mo because hindi mo nga character yun. Hindi mo nature yun eh. I don't like mo, yeah. oh, diba? yeah. So you'd rather not tell the world who you are and you'd rather let them perceive who you are and you're fine with it. And you'll just keep who you are to yourself. <sighs> sapol? <laughs> Wait, what does sapol mean? Yung mga uh, ibang words hindi ko alam. Did I like, hit it? Uh, okay. Did yeah, I nail yeah, it? So, uh, Diba? I don't know because it's hard. I mean, I do. I like you're on my Facebook. You're my Facebook yeah. friend. I, I share my heart out there mm. all the time, and and you share your heart out there, which means yung gusto mong ipakita sa amin yun ang pinapakita mo sa amin. But yung ikaw mm-hmm. na walang tumitingin sino yon? Um. Hala, maiiyak ako. Ano ba pa ako naman ni? Eh? Um, I... Ah! I love people. I, I genuinely love people. And, uh... Yun! I don't know. Uh... Ano ba yun? I put myself, you know... Last. Last, yeah. So, I'm hard. I'm hard on myself. I think I don't like. You know, when you you know, ask the interview me, parang bakit ako? Sino ba ako? You interviewed Martin, you know. But thank you, thank you for. Ano ba Mike yun? tissue. <laughs> no money. <laughs> Allah. <laughs> we'll be back after this. After this break, huh? We'll be back. Na, ano ka ba naman? <laughs> yeah, we're back. <laughs> <laughs> Pati <ako> na iyak. <laughs> Ay, grabe. Oh, hindi, okay lang ako sa tissue. Okay lang ako. <laughs> okay. And, you know, thanks for, thanks for your authenticity and thanks for being honest, no? And I'm pretty sure marami rin taong naiiyak watching this because of how they feel for themselves. 
And it's really hard to be honest to yourself. Eh? Because sometimes your honesty can cause hurt to the ones you love. Mm-hmm. And means you just want to keep that to yourself. Dahil ayaw mong makasakit sa ibang tao. And that's understandable. Pero anong advice mo sa mga taong nakakaramdam? We'll land this now. Anong advice mo sa mga taong nakakaramdam ng nararamdaman mo? And they have the opportunity to to be at the crossroad and change the trajectory of their lives. What can you advise them if they're start if they're in their twenties, and then if they're in their thirties, and then if they're in their forties? I would say na if they're in their twenties and you know lapang pamilya like to you know take care of and, and all of that. yung Mr. M opportunity sa buhay Oh, nila. grab it! I would grab it if I could go back in time back in 1999. I would grab it. I would yeah. Okay. For sure, yeah, yeah. No questions now in my mind. Kahit ano, like I would have, yeah. Papa iwan na lang ako do. Right. Um, and then in the thirties, kung if you have young kids, I think that that's so hard. To, you know, like I, I think find a balance. Mahirap kasi ayun na naman. Um, kasi nga for me, like I, family is so important. Yes. You know, like you don't want to like. Uh, I don't know. And you, you know, grew up like, in a close knit family. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Na you know, families first. So, yes. um, kung thirties ka and like you know, you can still uproot your family. Why not? You right. know what I mean? Like, kung nothing's really holding you back here, and you know, the kids are small enough that they can live somewhere else, mm-hmm. then that's fine. But um, if it's harder and harder, you know, like you know, if my husband has his career here, and you know, my kids are like all different ages now, yes. and you know, have like made their friends here now, um, and it's not like a for sure na kung kung sana kung for sure na oh yes. yeah, you're really yes. gonna be successful, and you know, like right. e- everything you ever dreamed about. Parang you know? parang feeling it's too selfish to take a risk at thirty, lalo na kung may mga sabit na kung may mga kids nang involved. Um, I mean, depending, thirty uh, still. Kind of young, right? Okay. Ako, ako, I'm in the next decade. Now. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. uh, I'm 40. So, okay. um, you know, like for me, it, it really depends diba, on the person and and whoever you're with. Yeah. Like, because some people are like, yeah, sure, let's go. Let's, you know, game. Like, let's move somewhere else. But, um, hindi ganun yung husband ko nga. And, like, you know, my kids, uh, yeah. It, this is too risky. It would be like too risky because you know, what if we uproot everything and then we lose everything? Correct. You know, and Correct. it's like <gasps> I don't, I don't want to ruin you know anyone's life because of my selfishness. But yeah. I don't so, but if you're young enough, go for it, <laughs> go for it, and and find people that you know support you. Find people that support you, and like I think that God has blessed me so much with people that believe in me even when I don't believe in myself. You know, like talagang. Ah, I, I cannot, you know, express my gratitude like to all my family and friends that have really, you know, pushed me and, and tried to help me see what they see. Is it is it fair to say that uh, an attitude of gratitude, one that you have, has kept you grounded and strong? Yeah. Kait mahirap yung mga ibang days. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure, yeah. Like I told you, like your mommy, I mean, you know, yes. was the one that really taught us na kahit kahit ano mangyari, you know, you still, you're alive, you have your family, you have a roof over your head, like be thankful. So, kahit na the smallest things, you know, I'm like, thank you, God. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know, kahit na, and basta, any little thing, like this, you know, thank you, God. <laughs> Ganun. I think it's really important to, to be grateful. I guess we'll end it there. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Noreen Lani. All right.